Hello and welcome everybody. I don't know where the music is, but I know that we are in Battle Brothers with the Fränkische Knaben and we have something ahead of us. Maybe our last mission. I always feel like it's the last mission if something goes so terribly wrong as it did right there. And we lost one person and now we have to try and get it repaired in Grünfeld. And we have to wait for the market to, to reopen, so... Uh, let's just let's just camp for the time being. Once it's dawn, we can. Man, our money is really yeah. We're we're not having a good time with money here, do we? Um, we can sell a lot of stuff though. We we got a lot of stuff that we don't really need. It's also worth nothing. So this is just terrific. Um, we do need a new person. If they if they have a new person here for me, then I would love to take him. Yeah, Yanol. You know what? Day Taylor. I want to take her. Who knows how long you're going to live, but but I need somebody that can fill the gap right here. That is the exact gap that I was talking about. Now I'm going to give you another spear and then I'm going to put you into this position. And then we're going to try it out, okay? We're going to try to have two spear walls and we're going to see where we can go from there. I mean, I don't fucking know. I have no idea, you know? It's, it's one of those things where just like, I don't know. Nobody, nobody told me ahead of time that I would have to do this, so... I'm uncertain of the consequences of my actions. Let's sell some stuff here. Um, sell all of this, honestly. It's going to give us a bit of breathing room. Don't really want to invest in... We want to invest... Uh, let's, let's sell the knife as well. I don't think we want to invest in tools and supplies. I don't think we can afford it. And now let's go down here. Let's see what we can do. I mean, we just killed some of their brigands. So maybe that's going to help us, but... Who knows how many people are in there? I don't know. I have no clue and it could be absolutely fatal. Some brigand raiders. What does that even mean? I wonder. Had we not killed the brigand raiders, would they have now been here in the defense of these five people? Because five people, I think we can handle. I think we're like, you know, in a, in a place that is good enough to handle five people. And you're just going to wait until they come closer. Yep, that's what I thought. We're really making an effort here to come much closer. Not really a big fan of it, I'll be honest with you. Um, I'm going to put you closer. And then I'm going to try to knock you down, I guess. Actually, I think I can... Yeah, there you go. That's what I thought. Nice. Now, as for you... Brr, I don't know. I don't really want him there. I'm going to wait with him and then put him somewhere over there, I think. Oh, this is, see, this is perfect. Now that is ideal. Genuinely ideal. Mm, I would love if I could just punch some in, ugh, well. <laughs> I could just punch some into you, yeah, okay, okay. Did he already move? No, he did not. I'm going to wait with you and see where he goes. If he goes over here, I can hit him, probably, maybe. Not sure. Uh, but we can take a look at it and then judge from there. Can I hit you? No can however go over here and then hit you or you for that matter i guess 65 percent i think he's what does he what is his what is his weapon what is that is that a spear no it's not it's like a i don't know we hit him all right fair enough he is also wavering already he is uh, pierced le leg muscles so that's quite nice all right all right let's let's go from there that's a good spot to start i think I don't want to go with you yet. I am thinking. I'm I'm thinking here, right? I want to go with you over here. And then I want to knock you out of Oh. Let's go. He's stunned, baby. That is fucking right. I'm going to could totally wait with him. You know what? I'm going to try to hit you though. Let's go. He's breaking, boys. He's breaking. Now he's coming closer. And that is exactly what I had in mind for him. Now you're gonna go in here, you're gonna crush his shield, and then you're gonna go nothing else. Fair. <laughs> Fair enough, quite frankly. With you, honestly, I kinda wanna pull back because he has to go around. I'm gonna go right here, goodbye. And then you are next, next turn, and then you can try to pull some strings, maybe, potentially. I don't know, kinda doubt it now that I said it out loud. All right, that's just a stab that didn't do anything, what a ridiculous sentiment um i could go down here and i think that is what we have to do isn't it everything else is just so far away i'm gonna go down here and then attack you 
Let's go, boys. That's what you do. That is what you do. 59% chance to hit 17. 64. Let's go. Easy money. He went up here and he's gonna try once, but that's it. Can't really do much. Uh, missed this once, missed this twice. That is how the story goes, boys. 63% uh, to kick him down. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. I'm gonna keep this spot open. Oh, you know what? I'm totally... No, I'm actually gonna keep this spot open. I'm gonna do it like this. But if I do get the chance... We're going to fuck him over. What I'm going to do with you, I'm going to come right behind these two and then we're going to shoot him. Let's go. This is the time. This battle. Oh, what? Are you seeing this? So with the weapon that he has, you can attack over two tiles. That is fascinating. Could walk over here, I guess, but I mean, what's the point? Hmm. I'm going to think about this in a second here. Let's just take a look what we can do right now. Yeah, punch him. Egg. Stab him, I mean. And... Down you go, buddy. And first, next turn. You already go over here, thank you very much. Now you, huh? You could totally be knocked out. Why not, right? Also just hit you. Let's just hit you. I want to actually inflict 30 to 45 damage to armor. I kind of don't want to destroy his armor. So if I just knock him out, that would be perfect. Let's go. All right. Perfect. Now with that being done, maybe I do want to knock you out. What do you think? Yeah. What do you think? Yeah. Ah, I guess. All right. Fair enough. You know what? Fair enough. I've seen and, and you, you just... Oh, I'm actually worried about you now that I see that. Hmm, I'm gonna put you right here. When is your turn? Quite soon, actually. Can totally go here and then split your shield. That, that is a... Now that's a plan. Shield. Killed. killed. Beautiful. Absolutely wonderful. 64%. 45. Oh, you missed him. 75. Let's go. And he missed. Whew. Could have been way worse. Could have been way worse. Like seriously worse. Stab. And off we go. <sighs> I really didn't anticipate him hitting there. But I mean. I guess that's the story of my life. eh? He didn't get knocked. Alright. It's time to kill one of you two. You are both breaking now. I think I'd rather... So you have a injured shoulder, broken nose. I think I'm gonna go for this man. But also just no, don't want definitely don't do that. What do you think here? 68%, 73. I think if I chop him off, then he goes too. Ah, uh, he's I mean he's fleeing now, but that's not the one that I wanted to have fleeing. Shit. Um I'm gonna bring you down here. Then you get stabbed. I kind of... Oh, but you're in range, right? Come on. Shit. That was bad. Very unlucky, actually. Like, insanely unlucky, really. Mm, if I move up... Can't actually attack because I'm an idiot. Uh, oh, come. Fuck. Oh, lucky. So lucky. Man. You know what? We got a lot of undeserved luck here, but I'm gonna I'm gonna fucking take it. I don't have any shame, okay? That's not how I roll. I just do things. And there you go. Now everybody's fleeing. That's perfect. Uh I want you to attack and then the other one can release the hounds. That's how we play this these days. Oh come on, dude. Right. Uh who's the who's the Did the dog man die? Was that the dog man that died? No, okay. Oh, God. You scared me, game. You scared me. Alright, and he's gonna try to run, and that's not gonna go well for him. Run him down. We're gonna get him. Look at that. No, you don't, you don't gotta do anything. Don't have to do anything. 
Oh, come on. There you go. Good fight. That was a good, good fight, everybody. I'm extraordinarily happy about that. And I do think... Hooked... Hooked Blade. Hooked Blades, everybody. I do think that it actually was good that we killed the brigands earlier because I think otherwise this would have been a big fight. Maybe I misinformed you, but I honestly think that's how that works. And we succeeded! And are now in a position to claim our reward in Arbeck. God, it's good to be king. But also, it's good to finally fucking win one. We really did deserve it, honestly. We really did deserve it. Say what you will, but... Whew, good fighting, good fighting. First Arbeck company, interesting. Got their own little company going. Mm, let me actually try... Oh, you know what? After every battle, I legit sh should check the inventory and such. Because the way I see it, the earlier you do that, the less they repair, repair things that you might not even ha want repaired, you know? So you got a strike. Two tiles. 44 to 77. Nah, this sp split man is honestly better. I don't know. Maybe we want one split man. Maybe we want one split man and one hooked. But I don't know which one for which. Maybe you... I'm gonna try it, right? I'm gonna try to go here with the hooked blade. I wanna test it out, see how it goes. And I'm also gonna give you this so that you stop being touched by everybody. Good. Move on. Alright. Good progress so far. At 2,000 crowns, we are not even close yet. Sad swords don't sit right with many folks. I suppose on the account of your killing and destroying whole villages on a short-changed whim, but I'll admit you've done good. And he nods to a corner of the room where a wooden chest lays unopened. It's all there, but I won't be offended if you need to count it. You do count it, and it is indeed all there. Nice. Baby. That is how that goes. Right, it's night. Now let me think. I don't want to waste any time. Look at the Lords of War. Interesting. Free mercenary company traveling the lands and lending their souls to the highest bidder. Hired by House Krieger. Interesting. I am thinking we go to Grunfelder. I think they had a different contract there. And I just accidentally clicked right here. Don't you worry about it, yeah? Um, they are probably still rebuilding. I think the rebuilding status is attached to one of their missions. Brigand Hunters, huh? That's a lot of archers. I can, I already know that. The Brigand Hunters are just like seven archers and it's a pain in the ass. Last time we fought something like that, we did quite well, but not well enough for me to feel comfortable about confronting them. Let me actually check. Do I want somebody else? I think, yeah, you get a Morning Star, buddy. That's a clearly, that's clearly a better weapon than what you had earlier. With a Morning Star, you can still knock him out, right? Wait, before I do something stupid here. Yeah, 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 okay. Don't you worry about it then. Uh, I will keep the woodcutter's axe though. Kinda wanna sell the mead. Hmm, I wanna sell the mead, yeah. Spoil in one day. I wanna sell it as is. Don't wanna buy any of the stuff that they have. Let's take a look at their contracts. You sit alone, studying a map as a stiff breeze tries to take off with it. As you struggle to keep the sheet on the table, Ziegbald Orkbane, one of your men, approaches and slams a mug on the paper's corner. You look up to see he's a bit slack-jawed with drink on his breath. He explains that he shared stories with a local by the name of Arnold of Grunfelder, who has a proposal for you. The maps and the lands they detail aren't going anywhere, so you agree to meet with him and hear him out. Selsword, you familiar with how dangerous the roads are these days? By the gods, that is some good wine. Oh, uh, good then. Go good. Then you'll understand this task I have for you. I need a caravan escorted along the roads of Zattelburg about a day from here. Pretty simple, right? Let's talk money. Okay, okay. How do you arrive with? Uh, two crowns. I mean, if you find like five people, it's ten bucks. That's not worth it. Um, I need to be paid more for this, just in general. For up to 20 ads. Ugh, whatever, dude. I'll take it. He's like an easy miss uh, mission. Provisions are provided, as is tradition. Yeah, let's do it. Eight people should be fine, too. I don't think I need to hire anybody for that. Now, let's see if we get attacked. Maybe we don't even get attacked. I mean, I don't know. I would guess that there's probably somebody out for us here at this time. 
But we're so close even to this trading post. Why did the forest just change? Excuse me? Yeah, it looks like there's not even going to be one battle. Fascinating, isn't it? And there you go. Sattelburg is now well supplied, which to me means that I want to buy from Sattelburg, don't I? Because that should mean that the tools... Oh, look at this. Oh, we gotta buy fucking tools, let me tell you. I'm gonna buy... You know what? I'm gonna buy three. I'm gonna buy th tools three times. Because I really, really need tools to be stocked up. Alright. And now uh, let's check out if we can't find a different mission. I mean, we could go back to Tannheim. It's just like, why would you go there, right? Hmm. Actually, let's try it. Let's go back to Tannheim. Maybe they have some good conditions. Maybe they just have somebody that I can hire. If they did have somebody that, you know, would be hireable, I would do it. I don't see why not. And it is our... Ooh. Disappearing villages. We can hire Volker the Kid. He is an apprentice. Everything looks up to, be be uh, to the best, but no one gets there in an instant. When Lonneberg's college asked for apprentices, Volker was the first to sign up. He had soaked up all there was to learn. Now he turns his eyes on the martial arts. Right, mate. I'm gonna teach you about martial arts, am I not, yeah? Um, what are we gonna do with him, though? That's actually a good question. I'm gonna put you in... Oh, I'm actually gonna give you some defense, at least, whatever. And after that, I think more fatigue would be nice. Once we better upon survive instead with a few hit points left. Interesting. Did I give that to him? I don't think I did. Did I? Did I misclick that? I don't know. Uh, huh, huh, huh. What do we do with you? I think I want to just give him the student trade. It's it's something you should always do when you have the option, really. Like if you're prepared to actually do it, you know. I'm going to give you more hit points, as you should have more hit points to survive, really. And then I'm going to... What, what do you do? Night Owl, and has a 90% chance to survive if struck down and not killed by a fatality. Hmm. Hmm. I would like... this. I think this is okay. Alright, and now let's go to Tannheim. Vander the Wise waves you into his room. It's a two-skull mission. No! Why? I'm gonna take it. We're gonna try it, right? You notice that there are pitchfork armed men keeping vigilant watch by means of grimly staring out his windows. Though one of these fellows is clearly asleep against the wall. Townsfolk in the interland are reporting monstrosities, taking children and dogs and they like and the like. Now, I don't mean to give leeway to paranoia and superstition, but it sounds an awful lot like these reports are taking, talking about spiders. I didn't even know there were spiders in this game. Webknechts, as my father would call them. And if it's true, then it's likely they've, uh, they have a nest in these parts, and I need you to find and destroy it. Are you interested, sir? 5.30. 5.30. I want to try it. I want to try it. So, do we know where? In the woods around Tannheim. Like, let's just go north here. As long as it's day, I think it's nice. Oh, look at this. We already found him. Let's, let's stay outside of the woods. You think that's it? Uh, I'm scared of the night when it comes to spiders. You probably don't want to fight him at night, eh? We do have a night owl, but I don't think that's enough. I think we're gonna hang out close to the close to the street here. And as much as it pains me to spend one entire day doing that, I think better safe than sorry. What the f oh, eight? Well, fuck me. All right. The nest of Webknecht is a pit of earth wreathed in white. At its rim are thin filaments which list, ab list about at even the slightest suggestion of a breeze. Marching your company inward, the webbing begins to take a sort of civilized shape, as though you were walking in from wintry hinterland. The recency of its creation appear in, uh, apparent in its tight trappings. Deer dogs, man-sized cocoons which show up no sign of life, 
show no sign of life, all bound snug in the hangars of white silos and planes like morses lost upon a pale rug. What a really well written sentence that I can't read. A black, sh a black shadow saunters up behind the veiled domicile. We're gonna, we're gonna get spooked, isn't it? I think this is a suicide mission. Coming to the fore with its legs squatting defilade. Its head crouched beyond them as though the foul cretain, a cretin, were gated by its own stride. A human hand sucks in and out from its mandibles like some macabre pacifier. You've come to the right place. Can't make out, is it? What? I, f I started fighting him. Oh, we're surrounded. This is fucked. Seem pretty small, right? We can cut him. We can kill him. But can we cut him? Man, being surrounded is, is awful, yeah. At least the resolve appears to be high. 39% chance, huh? I'm gonna walk right behind you and try to shoot him and see what that does. 51%. <sighs> not bad, not bad. Would have been way worse. I'm gonna go up here, shoot you. 56, 50. There you go. All right. You know what? Maybe we can do this. I'm not certain yet, but maybe we can. Let's go. Let's go. We're getting them done. We're getting them out of here, boys. I'm going to move you right here so that you have to walk a bit further. Hopefully making it so that uh, we run into some trouble. And what do we do with you? Because you're not quick enough to actually go in, you know that? Hmm... Like, I, I can't actually attack with him unless he moves away, which is silly. All things considered. And I... Oh, no! Now I skipped his turn. Fuck, I, I keep pressing spacebar. Well, um, 37% chance to hit is what I meant to say there. I think what I would like to do is to knock you out. <sighs> Alright, at least we knocked him out at the end of the day. Alright, let's take a look. Hook. Target two tiles away hooked and pulled close if there's space. Anyone hit will be... Could I pull you over here? Like, could I pull him over here? Because then I can definitely attack him. 35, 49% chance. We killed him. Immediately killed him. Cool. You go next. Alright, now you. I'm just going to position you here in the hopes that they will actually attack you because you do have a shield we can get him to attack you we might be well off here let's go they're dying like flies let's go boys there's some more waiting up there but we're in a really good see, see this position they can't come in this dude is guarding it and i i can't go in that right um i am Going to move right over here. And they're gonna hang out for the time being. Now with you, I don't know. I don't think I can do anything with you. What I could do is, I guess, I could go uh, go south here. I think that is what we're going to do. Right, it's your turn. What do we do with you? Forty percent chance to hit. Forty percent chance to hit. Ah, of course. Oh shit. Oh, he wept me! You shitter! And he wept me too! Get out of here. That's not right. And you know it. That's not right. Yeah, he's dead. I'm I'm worried about the <laughs> I'm worried about the East here, yeah? I'm a bit worried about that one. And we hit him. That's that's wonderful. Gorgeous. Fuck. That hit would have been very important. See, now they're, they're almost dead, but they're not dead. Oh, okay, let's take a look here. So, you get additional actions. Use everything at your disposal to free yourself from breaking what is holding you in place. Hack slash cut or ignore. Has a 38% chance to succeed. That is such shit. Wow, that is barely anything. 38, come on, man. I mean, the thing is, do I want to walk? It doesn't bring down my percentage to hit, so... I don't feel like I actually want to walk away. I might as well, right? I think. 
however the heck that was. Um, totally couldn't kill her. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna go over here. And I'm gonna like I'm gonna try to free him with you, but that's about it. I think that's a I think that's a good strategy. And I'm certain that you will be sure to correct me. And then with you, I'm just gonna I'm honestly literally just gonna form a spear. Well, what is he gonna do? Go cry about it, bitch. Now with you, I do want to murder. Oh fudge! Uh, you think we knock him out? I think we knock him out here. <laughs> Alrighty. Okay then. There you go. That's a spear. Oh. <gasps> no, no, he's poisoned him. Don't poison me. Missed it. Okay. All right. Look, we got very lucky here, but we still got poisoned. That's unacceptable. Can't hit anybody except you. Fuck me. Hmm. Can't even step off. I want to wait with that. If we can kill him. Yeah, that's what I thought. In that case, you don't have to shoot. You can do other things. Um. Free ally. Didn't work. Worked. It's poison, right? Yeah, two people are poisoned. Fuck, you know. Oh, boy. Now with you, we have to kill. We have to kill. It's not dead. Okay. Alright. See how it is. We can just stay here, kind of frighten this spider maybe, hopefully. <laughs> At least a little bit. And okay, that spider's gone. Show me, uh, show me the poison. What is the poison effect exactly? There has to be something here, right? Can't see it. Nothing here on the ground, whatever, dude. Um, I mean, we have to stab you, I guess. Or I could just push you away. Yeah, I'm gonna push you away, actually, I think. He's so stuck and fucked. Yeah, he's he's in dire need of... Like, I think he's gonna die, actually. Hmm. But freeing him doesn't really do anything, does it? Didn't even fucking work. <laughs> it didn't even work. Alright, it's not dead. It's not running. He's dead. Like, he's dead. I don't... I don't know. I, I don't see any hope. I'll walk with you. Alright, I guess. Whatever, dude. I walk with either of you. Could shoot you, I guess. If that had worked. Oh! There's one more down there! But if that had worked, you would say, like, wow, you're so smart. Yeah, we got this dead. <sighs> Vigald is dead, huh? That's shit. It's very, very shit. Oh, come on. Alright, one spider gone. That's okay. That's, it's, a, it's a dead spider. What do you want me to say? Oh no, you killed a spider. I Vigald being dead is just saddening, but... I mean, what are you gonna do about it, really, in these circumstances, you know? You don't have an infinite amount of options here. I don't need to shoot you. I, I want to shoot you. Ugh. I want to shoot you, though. Um, If I could, and I totally can, I would love to retreat with this man. Fuck. Now I totally can't anymore, so I'm just going to stab you. And then I'm going to walk in right here. Walk in right nowhere. Fuck. Gonna walk in right here, yeah. So that he can't go around and hit him. Oh, what is this? Hidden? No, they can see me. I'm sh I'm certain they can see me. Excuse me. Right. Um. You. Ugh, come on. At least he goes first. All right. He got knocked down. That's good. That is really good. Important. Important stuff right here. Now you. You, you gotta do it. Yes! Alright, four more to go. Where are the four coming from? Are you joking? One, two. I only see two. Where the fuck is the rest? I'm gonna hide behind you. Still don't know whether... Oh, he's running. Oh, baby, he running. Yeah, they're running. 
it appears. Are they? I don't know. Can't walk anyway, don't worry about it. You're gonna stay here, you're gonna reload and stay. I don't know. I'm, I don't want to follow him because they're not actually fleeing. And I'm not gonna be trapped by some fucking spiders. Do I look like I'm gonna be trapped by spiders? Are you crazy? He's still poisoned. Uh, it's over. No, 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 it's over. I don't know where the rest is, but we lost Vigal the idiot. And as bad as he was as a character, I still wish we didn't. We got a poison gland, we got some ghost gossamer, gathered from the remains of a Webknecht. Light is strong and is superior to most common materials, if only it weren't so sticky. Alright, you know what? We got the stuff from Vigal back, which is very cynical, but we got it back. We can just give it to somebody else. We won the battle and uh, the last of the Webknechts is finally de uh, dealt with. Its legs gating itself and as in as though to eternally clutch at the weapon which had slain it. He ordered the company's good work, then ordered the whole place torched. Fires rapidly run the length of the webs, breaking bridges of filament apart and sending fiery doom to their connectors. The whole nest is consumed in the inferno, and somewhere deep in its bedding you hear the shrill cry of spidling set alight. I'm gonna tell you straight up, we're doing way better than last time. I'm still very, like... ...thoughtful of, uh... How terribly wrong everything could just go within a minute, but man, we're doing well. Vander the Wise meets you at the town entrance, and there's a crowd of folk beside him. He walks, he welcomes you warmly, stating he had a scout following you who saw the whole battle unfold. After he hands you your reward, the townsfolk come forward one by one, many of which are reluctant to stare sellsword in the eyes, but they offer a few gifts as thanks for relieving them of the Webknecht horrors. Successful hunt indeed. Alright, we made some money, but we're not really, like, the thing is we're still in the red when it comes to the actual numbers. You're not making money, we're just stuffing our downfall, really. Mm, that's not, no, we're not going to sell that here. I think you want to sell these probably in a big town because they're so... Traders will be, oh, okay, I'm going to sell this. But these probably in a big town because they're so, like, unique and, and you know, strange, kind of. I'm going to keep all of the other stuff around and I'm going to level you up. Um, Janold. Oh, and I think, good thing that I actually consciously think about this. Starting next episode, depending on the enemy, I will look at our gear. Maybe there's like better gear for better, for certain opponents, you know? Obviously, like, you don't need anything to crush armor against spiders. What's the point? They do have armor, but like, n nowhere close to the degree of like properly armored enemies. So, this only makes sense, really. Uh, let's get the defense up, let's get the attack up, and let's get our health up my personal view on this topic and with you I am going to go ahead and give us Colossus here so you survive for the for the future all right and so far so good a better playthrough so far compared to the last one we are doing quite well we have a good supply uh, in tools now and I will see you wait actually one moment no okay I will see you in the next episode of Battle Brothers. Later. Alligator.